when we're in the midst of a difficult season of life or working towards something tough, it can feel like that thing is just going to last forever, um, that there's no end, that just this this is what life's going to be moving forward. Um, and I think that's something that can definitely happen with the CPA exam. So just want to encourage you that you're not going to have to study for the CPA forever. Um, you're not going to always have to work about balancing your work and your studying. Um, you're not going to always have to spend nights and weekends preparing. You're not going to um, always have to have flashcards with you studying. You're not going to have so little free time because it feels like you should always be studying. You all always have to be thinking about um, when am I going to take my next section? When do I need to schedule it? You're not going to start have, you're not going to always have to worry about if your credits are going to expire in time for you to get all four. Um, you're not always going to have to think about what order should I take the exams in. You're not always going to have to be doing practice questions and simulations and worrying about do I do videos, do I do lectures. Um, you're not going to always have the anxiety of waiting for your scores. Um, you're not going to always have to worry about what happens if you don't get a 75. It's so all these things that are taking up your time and your attention when working toward your CPA. It's not going to be that way forever. Um, you know, like I said, when you're in the middle of a stressful time, it feels like forever, but um, it will get better. Um, I promise there, there is an end to the path. There is an end goal, an end accomplishment. Um, you know, there is a point you, you pass all four and you're done. Um, so there is a final destination, a final positive outcome to be reached. So keep working, keep showing, keep showing up, putting in the effort and um, you'll get there.